Hi to everyone. Today we are making sweet bread conchas. So we need the flour. I put one cup. Then we need to put three more cups. That's two. Three. Four cups of flour. So I have four cups of flour, then a half. So this is a half cup. So we'll put a half cup of sugar. Goes in. Then we cover the flour. Then we put to this, we're gonna put the baking powder. It will be one and a half a teaspoon. like a pinch of salt not a lot and then we'll put the hook in and we mix it Put the gist in so it can mix, and then we put two teaspoons of lard, and we mix it. We mix it until you see that it's like powdery flour. Everything has to be combined. Now that you see that everything is combined, you put the flour. It's going to be one cup. And if you see you need more, you can put half a cup more. The water has to be warm. You let it mix until you see that everything gets combined. And if you need more water, you can just go add in a little bit of water, a little bit of water until you see that you have a dough ball. So we'll come back when the dough is ready and I'll see you in a little bit. So you see how it's getting mixed? You just have to keep going like for five minutes. After the five minutes, and you see the dough is already like elastic, put it to rest for 30 minutes or to an hour. Then you will start doing the the. Okay, so now we're back. The dough was for five minutes, and now it's okay to like put it to rest. I'm gonna cover it with a plate, put it in a warm place, and we're just gonna let it rise for an hour i'll see you back okay so i'm again here now we're gonna do conchas with 
eggs, butter, and milk. Okay, so first we put the flour, so it's the same thing, four cups of flour. So that's one cup. Two. Three. And the four cups. So now we've got one half a cup of sugar. Then we cover the things up. Then we do this, we put everything. Then we put two teaspoons, one and a half actually. One and a half of baking powder. We put everything that we have on the bowl. Okay, then we put the, the yeast. We put the hook in. Try to put it in and then, sorry. And then we mix it. So since we said that this one doesn't have lard, but I forgot to put a pinch of salt, so we're gonna put a pinch of salt. Not a lot, just a pinch of salt. Then we put the butter in. Butter goes in, and we mix it. So then we see that everything is combined. Then we'll put the milk. It has to be warm, it's one and a half cups. cups and then you mix it then at this point you can put the eggs two eggs then you mix it Mix everything until everything is combined. Once you see everything is combined and there's no more flour on the bottom, then you let it go for five minutes more until everything is combined together. And then you put it to rest for an hour. We'll see you back when both of the doughs are ready to be do to we can do the contrast. Oh, I feel like it's too. I put a, a little bit more of the milk. Um, so now we're gonna. I'm gonna put um, half a cup of flour. I hope that will work. And I think it's it's going. Then you just let it rest for. You just let it go for five minutes, and then you let it rest. How I said. See you back later. So now we're doing the cover for the conchas. I have one cup of granulated sugar. And then I'm putting one cup of powdered sugar. It's 
So that's one cup of powder sugar. So I have one cup of sugar, regular sugar, and one cup of powdered sugar. So now we're gonna mix it. And then while it's mixing, we're gonna put the alarm. That is gonna be one cup. Let's put it down so I can put it in. So now I put one cup of lard because I'm putting two cups of flour. So now we mix it until everything is combined. Well mixed together. to look like a creamy consistency so just keep going Let me go get a spatula and come back. You can always scrape the sides. Let's turn it up a little bit and then move the sides to the middle so it can combine. Mix it up again. And then we mix it again. So I've been doing this like for four minutes maybe. Let's put the flour now. So let me put it down so I don't throw the flour everywhere. And then I will put two cups of flour. Okay, now we put it up again. And then we mix it again. Then we have to make combine like uh, like maybe like a dough, but it, it looks different. the same thing we scrape the sides because sometimes it sticks on the sides I'm gonna put it up again and mix it again
Okay, let me try to do it by hand and I'll see you back in a little bit into when I have it all combined. If it's more lard, you will know it because it has to be like together. But if not, you can just put one teaspoon of lard and um, I'll see you back in a little bit. So I mixed it by hand. I put three teaspoons more of lard and now we have the dough. Like it's like a dough, but it's sugar. And um, so it's a cover for the conchas. So when the dough is ready, I'll come back and show you how to make them or how I make them. So now we're gonna do the conchas. I have the pans, don't mind my pans, with lard. So I have the paste for the conchas, the thing that goes on top. Then I have the little balls. And then now we're gonna start doing them. I'll get one and then you go circle motions. Then you put it. Then we get another one. And then we do the same thing, circle motions. Circle, circle, circle. And you put it on the pan again. Then I'm gonna keep doing like 10 I think and then I'm gonna do another kind of bread that is gonna be just like you'll see when I when I do it that I can expel in there then you do circle motion circle motions and I see you back when I'm finished so now I have the little dots the balls then I'm gonna start doing like prepping it you put lard in your hand and then you go smashing them. You do the same with all of them. Then you start doing the cover for the conchas. So we're gonna do it, I'm gonna do it my way. So I'm gonna get um, like a tortilla maker. And then I'm gonna put like a little bag on top. Okay, it's a little bit, okay. Then I'm gonna get like a little ball of it. Like smaller than this. You take a little ball, then you put it on the middle, then you cover it with a bag, plastic bag, or then you do it like this, and then you do it like this. You open it, you have like a little tortilla of concha thing. Then you get the bag, and you put it on top of the concha, and you let it take it out and then you do it like this do it like this and then you do all of them the same way and I'll see you back when I finish doing all of them so now we let it rise for 30 minutes now 30 minutes pass and I think they're ready to go in the oven I'm gonna put them for 15 minutes And these ones are the ones that are with milk. So I'm gonna wait 15 minutes, 30 minutes till they rise, and then I'll put them in the oven for 15 minutes. 15 minutes later, I took them out of the oven and I think they look okay. So now they're out of the oven, the milk and not milk and the red ones, I already have them on the container. So um, thank you for watching the video. Um, see you next time, bye.